Ever wondered why this doesn't happen in reverse? Physics doesn't say it's impossible. The first law, the conservation of energy, would still be satisfied either way. So what does stop it? It's the second law of thermodynamics, a law not about how energy is conserved, but about how energy flows. For the second law says, heat does not spontaneously flow from cold to hot. But that's just a surface level version. It's not just about heat. It's about direction, a deep arrow of time written in physics. Your hot coffee cools down. It never reheats itself just because the air is colder. Engines can never convert all heat into work. There's always some loss to friction, to noise, to the universe. This is why no machine is 100% efficient. It is impossible to construct a heat engine that converts all the heat into work with no other effect. That's the second law's message. Nature allows energy to move, but not any way it wants only in directions that degrade usefulness. So the pieces on the floor could, in theory, reassemble. But the path of least resistance, the path nature follows, is always from order to mess, from useful energy to waste.